Are you guys still awake? Yeah. I know. Again, sorry, sorry that you know we're we're delayed, but we're trying hard to catch up. Um, just about any community <laughs> that I've been involved with, um, or I've seen from from far, has one person, just one person, who is so dedicated, so responsible, so enthusiastic about every project that, you know, that community wants to do. Um, you, you know what I'm talking about? Just about any community has that one person. And here in Pittsburgh, we also... Here in Pittsburgh, we also do have that one person. Um, she has been involved with many, many large-scale projects here in Pittsburgh. She has designed our beautiful half scene outside today. She has been one of the founders of the Persian Panthers. She has been in, she has been involved with um, nationality, the nationality, which we will we will be hearing about soon. It, again, you know, for the last three years that I've been in Pittsburgh, any project that I've heard of, she has been a part of it. And she's no one but our own, Ms. Akramek Komrani. Please join me. to know I went to Shiraz, Tabriz, Persepolis, all over the place, and I grew to love that culture. I studied Farsi, and when Akram came to my uh, office in the 12th floor of the Cathedral of Learning, and I heard there was an Iranian there, I went out and I said, Halisha Machatori, and she almost fell through the floor. <laughs> but anyway, I love the culture, and we eventually got to talking about doing a room. We don't have official uh, permission from the provost yet, but I think it's coming. 
So, uh, Akram will tell you the whole story, and I hope to see all of you. This has been a wonderful evening of thinking back and thinking forward. So, thank you all for inviting me.
an important uh, festival. We have been recently more involved in the 55th Pittsburgh Folk Festival. It has been there for 50, 40, 55 years. And Heidi and Rana and um, her other sister, they all were uh, involved, but we all need to help them. Last year I joined them and we had the Persian Cafe added to that, which was a success and people liked it. But again, this is coming in May. May 20. Make that day on your calendar, three-day festival. We are going to make the Persian cafe again with a traditional cafe style and we need as many people there to help us educate others about our culture. Please get in touch and sign up to get involved. And counted tickets are available at the door at, for $8 per person. So it's discounted. Thank you all and I hope you liked it and you learned a lot about the projects going on. And this is your to-do list. You better take some words. Sorry, Matt. Thank you. So now you know what I meant when I said she's involved with every project. She's amazing, isn't she? Great. Love energy. I don't know how she does it. Um, okay.